comes in as the Big 12's leading returning sack man. He's got 14 and a half in his career, and he just runs right around the tackle number 75, A.T. Hall, and then he gets that hand right up there, and he bats it on the elbow and knocks the ball loose. Florida Atlantic is glad that the first quarter is about to end, and it ends with a ball being lost by Driscoll. Slipped right out of his hands. A run back by Shermichuel Moore. Second and four, they're going to pass. Howard. Lost time, and down he goes. There's Jordan Willis doing what he does. The right tackle, Lazard, who had struggled. You see a little bit of a spin move right there. He went with power with the bull rush. It wasn't there, so he counters, gets the rip up. He counters, ice picks right there in the back, and he gets a nice sack of Skylar Howard to bring in pressure. And just a chop rip right there by Jordan Willis turning the corner. Skylar Howard losing his footing. A lot of races at the Kansas Motor Speedway. And Willis in hot pursuit again. He gets to Mahomes. Willis, that's his second sack tonight. He's up over 20 for his career now at Kansas State. Gonna get caught from the backside, and it's Willis. Ball is free, and they're gonna rule. The quarterback down on the sack for Jordan Willis. Down he goes. Jordan Willis gets through and makes the sack. Watch him coming from the outside. This goes inside, just a speed rush. A little bit of power there, but he's the guy that every single time he steps on the field, coach will talk about the effort and the energy he brings. Waycock now at five. Stanley under pressure. And he's sacked again. Making the tackle at the point of attack. Ball comes loose, and Sawyer is able to fall on top of it. Jordan Willis knocked it right out of his hands.